Hi, I'm Officer John Syme with the Independence Police Department. A year ago, we began the False Alarm Reduction Program where we reminded everyone about the required business and residential alarm permit process and notified everyone of the alarm program changes. The changes we made consisted of moving to a third party vendor named Crywolf to manage the alarm registration and billing for false alarms. Before this, we realized that there were, the officers were responding to an average of 15 false alarms per day. And this became a huge burden on our limited number of police officers and we wanted them to be available for the high priority calls that we are responsible for. From January through March of 2018, there were 1,106 false alarms. From January through March of 2019, there were 1,051 false alarms. This is a 4.97% decrease. In May of 2018, which was two months prior to the program start date, we had 458 false alarms. And in May of this year, we had 347. This was a 24.24% decrease. We hope to see these numbers continue to decrease to reduce the amount of time our police officers spend responding to false alarms, which will reduce their response time to more urgent calls for service. All alarm users in the City of Independence are required to register with the program under this city ordinance. This includes all private and business locations. Now, Registration is free, but there are fines for fail failing to register and renew, as well as a graduated penalty for repeat false alarms. Citizens and businesses with alarms can register online at crywolfservices.com slash independencemo and can call 855-732-9029 with any questions that you have about the program. The website also has helpful tips on how to reduce a majority of false alarms that are preventable with proper operation. Thanks for watching and stay safe.